you may know this or you may not know this. It is not right to do wrong to your spouse when your spouse does wrong to you. For instance, I am married now. And let's say for an example, not saying this is true. Let's say my wife does wrong to me every hour of the day. Every day, every hour of the day, which is, I guess, impossible, right? But let's say I say to myself, well, I am going to do wrong to her to get her to stop doing wrong to me. I am going to do it to make her feel what it feels to be wronged. Now, that would not be right. If she is doing wrong, I believe she is going to reap what she sows. If I am doing wrong, I am going to reap what I sow. So if we are both reaping what we are sowing, who actually wins? I believe not us, but demons. What we have to do, and I am not saying this is easy. What we have to do, married couple, we have to take wrong. Not saying we are okay with it, not saying we are asking for it, but we need to take wrong meaning yes you wronged me but i am going to try not to do wrong back to you i am going to take it pray to god about it maybe even fast to get things back to the way or get things to the way things should be all this getting revenge, eye for an eye, tooth for a tooth stuff is going to make things worse. And I believe God is going to punish everyone who chooses to do that. So your spouse may have wronged you, but you don't have no right to do wrong back unless you want consequences to come back upon you and you may say kevin i don't care you know my husband did me wrong my wife did me wrong so whatever happens happens you say that now you are saying that now but when they come are you going to feel the same way or are you just speaking out of emotion I believe it is speaking out of emotion. We need to learn how to... <sighs> Some things may not be able... You may not be able to fix some things, perhaps, with your words and actions. Some things, I would think, you need to rely on God for, if that makes any sense. In Ephesians 6 and 12, I think it is, is it 6 and 12? It speaks about we are in a spiritual war. So our wrestle is not with flesh and blood. So if our wrestle is not with flesh and blood, why are we fighting humans? Why are we fighting our spouse? Why are we fighting our enemies? We need to fight spiritually. If your words can't change anything, if your actions can't change anything, 
that is when probably beforehand too you need to pray and probably fast because if almost most of your conversations about trying to correct wrongdoing in the marriage goes to not you really need to pray and fast i would say so i hope this makes sense more than likely probably it is probably demons really doing stuff in your marriage more than likely i would say but you know i can't see all the time in the spirit and stuff like that so not all the time i guess do i see it any of the time i don't know but um i hope this makes sense let me stop here may god bless you